Um, but when it's summertime, it's hot. I just do not like to eat. A lot of people are like, oh my god, you haven't eaten all day. I just don't like it. So this chicken salad that someone introduced me to, um, I love. And then when I make it for people, they fall in love with it and they eat the whole container. So I wanted to share with you. So it's so easy and so simple. And if you can't cook, it's something great that you can have. So here we go. So celery, extra cheap. Everything's like under $2 a piece if you think about it. So celery. Um, I use green onions because I like green onions, but you can use regular onions. If you like the crunch in your breath, you, you like it a little funky, <laughs> use regular. Some people love regular. I use green onions. Um, I cheat. I just go get a rotisserie chicken. Bam. Um, this was $5 from Food Lion. Get that. Um, sea salt. You can use any salt that you want. I just like sea salt. Again, it's just me. Um, a little mayo, America Whip, whatever you like, your preference. A little pepper. I have um, butcher block pepper, but any type of pepper. And sweet relish. That's it. <laughs> simple, simple, so simple. Um, and what I do is take all that great stuff and mix it up. Let me get my mixing bowl. I'm just gonna put it in this little cute container because this is what I'm gonna store it in. So um, I, of course, I just open up the chicken. Let's move this out the way. And the chicken is already um, cooked. I already just cut my vegetables and stuff up. Now, it depends on if you like crunch. If you like the crunch of uh, celery or the onions, you just kind of cut it to the size that you like or you prefer. Um, it's totally up to you. So again, my daughter does not really like um, onions. She doesn't like to see the onions and taste the onions. So I went to the green onions and she doesn't even know they're in there. Um, but when we have regular onions, I just chop them up so finely so you don't even know that they're in there. Um, but it still gives it that flavor. The green onions give it a little different type of flavor. Not a huge type, but people usually don't know what's in there. Um, and it gives it a color, you know. So color is always popping for um, summertime. So and it's refreshing. All right, so I got those couple of things already cut up. So with the chicken, basically, I just really cannot stand when it's like cold and gooey already. Um, wow, Lord. All right. So I just take the chicken and then you just cut it up in parts. Let me get my bigger knife for that. Just be a man. Oh, There's my large size knife. Someone got me from a butcher block knife. Okay. Great. Um, this is another discard junk thing. Let's get all this out of the way so you can see. And I just cut the chicken open. Kind of makes it easier. Um, you may prefer to do it any way you want to do it, but I just like easiness and quick and fast. And so, Basically, all you're doing is just cutting the chicken up in pieces um, to your preference. Again, size doesn't matter. <laughs> totally up to you. Um, I take the skin off. I do not want skin in my chicken salad. But again, if you want it, good for you. And I just cut into the size of cubes that I want. And most of my friends are like, oh, you're cutting the chicken the wrong way. I don't really care. I just eat it, you know? And 
If you like chunky, then have the pieces big. If you like small, you can have the pieces. I mean, you know, you don't want to kind of taste all the chicken. I do not want to scan. Um, yeah, cut it up to how you like it. And that's how big I, I want it. And let's put the chicken in here. And you just keep going with the chicken like that. So. like your chicken salad kind of like wet or if you like it to be I don't know I can't say dry because you have mayonnaise <laughs> but if you don't like it it's moist um, again totally up to you you can add more mayo or you can add um, you know whatever you want Anytime pieces fall somewhere else, I always just put it on the side because I give it to my dog, which that's just what I do. And so pieces like this, I don't even try to really cut it up with so much. But you just keep going. And after you get the amount of chicken and stuff that you want, I'm only gonna do this much so I can show you guys how to do it. Um, it's not really like that much in there, but so you can see, you just add your, that's my green onions. Celery. And, I usually put my mayo in first because I just like to get the, oh, I can open it. I just like to get the um, consistency right because I don't like my mayo to be overly, I mean, my chicken salad to be overpowered by my mayo. So, because I didn't put all the chicken in there, I'm just gonna do like a little mayo. Cover it up. And mix it. It's probably better if I had a bowl, but okay. preference how much you want in there I like relish <laughs> so I like mine to be sweet and again you can make as much as or as little as you want you don't have to make a lot if you don't want it you know if you don't want to waste it or if you want to use the chicken for another dish you can And then um, you can either add garlic powder, salt, whatever you like, and salt and pepper. But that's it, that is simple. So I just add my pepper and, oops, where is it opening? And my salt. And today I am just going to put spinach on it. And 
And so this would be like a quick go-to thing that you can take to work or whatever. You can make it a salad. It's already in the container. And then cucumbers. So that was great. I would have had all this stuff out already, but I just thought of it as I was recording. That this would be great to have. Like a little refreshing salad. <laughs> already just from me making chicken salad. It's crazy. Um, what? There goes my refreshing Fresh and chicken salad. <laughs> Can you see it? Ta da! Peace out. <laughs>